Hi everyone, it's Felicia. Today I want to talk to you a little bit about what it means to be forgiving. You know, forgiveness is one of the most difficult things on the path because many of us unconsciously and unknowingly, forgiveness is our protection. It's the way that we keep us from getting harmed. It's the way that we feel safe. We don't even realize that when we're holding on to something, it actually is keeping it very much alive inside of us. And it's holding out all the good that's meant to come. You know, I have this um, practice I do when it comes to forgiveness. And it's a statement that I remind myself of, right? Progress, not perfection. Progress, not perfection. Because when I know that I am progressing, or I can see somebody around me progressing towards something, I'm very forgiving of myself and them as they move through whatever obstacles within themselves that keep them from being their best self. You know, I think this is a, a practice we all, we all have somebody we need to forgive or some situation or something in our life. And it's very difficult to go after that big task. So, you know, I'm one that says, how do you start? You know, if you've got something so big, what do you do to start? So start with today being more forgiving of yourself and know that you are progressing. You're not meant to be perfect. There's a teaching in the Lao Tzu that says, right, you are perfect and you could use improvement because the level of the soul, you're already perfect. You've already forgiven everything, right? But the ego, the outer part of us holds on to a lot. So what if we were forgiving today? You know, I went to the chiropractor recently and I was having some trouble in my body and I was getting really frustrated in my body and I was talking to him about writing. And he said, what if you wrote about forgiving? And it was like a light bulb went off and I went out to my car and I recited this poem and I'm going to share it with you. Forgiving, folding forward to touch the earth, I feel the ache of yesterday. I am forgiving of that day. I reach to the sky and I lift my heart. I am forgiving of myself. I offer grace to the heavens as it descends down deep, deep inside of my soul. I spread open my wings, the wings of my being. I forgive the past and I forgive all that will come. Again, I fold forward and touch the earth. It beckons me to lay down and I lay upon it. I forgive all the lifetimes in which I may have been untrustworthy, unfaithful, when I have forgotten the beauty of existence. I am forgiving. I am forgiving of all. I am forgiving of all who share this precious planet with me. So today, be forgiving of your body. Take care of it. Be forgiving of your mind when it's telling you things that are untrue. And maybe just be forgiving of your fellow man. Forgive the lady that's going too slow in front of you while she drives. Forgive the cashier if she's a little rude to you. Forgive the waitress who forgets your drink right, or your sandwich. Forgive the person next to you for being louder than you like. Forgive somebody in your home for not being perfect. Perfection is really a difficult thing for many of us. We want to be perfect. But when we know better, we do better. And that's a sense of progress. So I offer today to be forgiving of yourself and all others. In that, you can be the most amazing you in all you do. Many blessings. You are forgiven.